An important difference between drill pipe and drill collars lies in the properties and handling characteristics of their connections. The tool joint connection is generally the strongest part of a joint of drill pipe. But the opposite holds true for a drill collar's rotary shoulder connections. When a drill pipe tool joint becomes damaged, it can often be returned to service after reworking the threads. A drill collar connection, on the other hand, can never be made as strong as the drill collar body. It is a sacrificial element. When it becomes worn, it must be cut off and replaced by machining new threads. Thus, when drill collars fail, the failure most often occurs at the connections. Design of the best rotary shouldered connection for a drill collar calls for the pin and box to be balanced in bending fatigue. A rule of thumb for obtaining this balance is for the box connection to be two and a half times stronger than the pin. Torsional strength is another important structural property of rotary shouldered connections because it determines the required makeup torque for the drill collar. Torque requirements are included as part of drill collar connection specifications. Good connections are designed to fit drill collars through 11 inch OD. A problem, however, is that not many rigs may have the equipment needed to properly make up such large connections. This problem may be alleviated in some cases by using drill collars with fishing necks, low torque face connections, or a combination of the two. Remember that it is better to have sufficient torque on a modified end, or even to use a smaller collar, than to have inadequate torque on the full size end of a larger collar.